Hey everybody, it's John here from TheGimmyAct.com. Here we are today, back in 2064, grabbing the Threat Neutralize achievement. This is going to be done in Chapter 6. This is right after you get out of the sewers into Parallax's servers. I highly recommend making a save here, because this achievement is quite possibly the second hardest achievement in the game, next to the Mega Phobator achievement. So the reason for that is, once again, because of the awful shooting controls. So once you move forward, these robots are going to start attacking you. There are going to be a total of four waves. The first one's really easy, you just need to shoot the center, and the robot goes down in one hit. Now, the trick to making this achievement a lot easier is to make sure you make a save between waves. So if you have a successful wave where you don't take a hit, make sure you make a save. That way, if you take a hit during the next wave, you don't have to start the whole thing over again. So move forward, and then you have wave 2. This one's going to be a little harder since you have the flying guys to deal with who take two hits to go down. My best advice is to try to hit enemies while they intersect other enemies. For example, if there are two enemies on a grid, you can shoot them and then both of them will take the hit. So you just want to kind of repeat that strategy for the rest of the playthrough. And of course, my best advice is to use the D-pad rather than the analog stick for these shooting segments. You are probably going to have the hardest time if you're doing this on Xbox. If you're doing this on PC, you have the benefit of the mouse. And if you're doing this on PS4, you have the benefit of using the touchpad. And I believe the Vita, you can use the touch controls as well. But for the Xbox, you just have to be quick on your feet and get used to the enemy's patterns. The enemy patterns are pretty much always going to be the same, and they do react to where you shoot. So you can kind of cheese them into crossing each other up, and then you can just take them all out in one hit. And that's my best advice, is to just practice. So, as you can see, wave 3 we got done, and now we have wave 4, which is quite possibly the hardest way, since we have 3 flying guys and 2 of the bigger robots. The bigger robots take 3 hits to go down, so take advantage of that overlap strategy. As you can see here, we're going to start on the left, go center, and then just stick to the top, and that is how you want to get that wave done. So, if you manage to do all 4 without taking a hit, you should be on your way to the achievement. So, after about a dozen or so tries, we managed to get the fourth wave done. There's the achievement, 10 gamer score, and that's all there is to it.